So that may be true for, for some of you listening is you have done something in your life where you've avoided dealing with your own emotions to the point that when it comes to someone else's emotions, you feel really uh, out of place. You really have no idea what to do with those emotions. And, um, you know, in my past, my addictive behavior, I went and medicated those feelings versus really trying to address those feelings. So when Lori would share with me her upset, I just wanted to fix it. I wanted it to stop. And when you do that, (laughs) the other person is shut down. Their, um, the value of their emotions is not addressed. And so they're kind of shut down by the conversation. That's what happens when we try to fix it. Now, there is a place to say, okay, now that you've shared, what can I do about this? Or is there something you want me to do about this? But when that's our go-to, when Lori would say to me, Jay, this really hurts. And I'm like, oh, well, if you understood, it wouldn't hurt so bad. And I wouldn't value her feelings. I wouldn't value her emotions. And that led to her being kind of generally pissed at me. Not because of um, continuing in my negative behaviors, but because her feelings weren't valued. Mm 